Hello, hello, my friends. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is really different. So, um, as you guys have seen, there's a lot of variation of river going around, you know, social media and um, everywhere online. And as much as I love river in that variation, I'm kind of ready for a new rainbow high boy so with that said i'm going to do a hybrid of river and you guys are going to be so excited when i show you this because the possibilities are endless first things first i'm removing his head and i'm going to be replacing it with yes you guys i'm going to be replacing river's head with karma's now the reason why I have chosen Karma is because her skin tone and River's skin tone are very similar and I believe that it's going to look amazing. Um, what I'm going to do is remove the eyes and color the hair. Um, we're coloring it brown and yeah you guys let's start. First things first, I will be removing all his clothes because we need to give a river a new wardrobe. So with that said, his jeans are going to be dyed black and his shoes are going to be painted as well. Now that all his clothes are off you guys I'm going to be setting them aside because I will dip them in a black writ dye as well and his shoes are going to be painted and his other set the other shoes as well um, I don't know what I'm gonna do with them yet but I'll figure it out I also want to see what I can do with this outfit now it's on to um, removing his head so I'm gonna go and grab some hot water and dip his head in it yep you guys here it is I just put his head in some really hot water I will leave it for two minutes and then remove it please use a towel have an adult help you if you guys are attempting to do this now that the head is off, I'm going to set him aside and dip Karma in, you guys, because I want to remove her eyes. All right, you guys, I just want to show you that I will be using Rit Dye All Purpose um, Black Color, and um, I'm going to use that in boiling water and yeah i think karma should be ready now for me to pull her because i do want to uh, show you how i will be removing her eyes you guys so just push really hard and the eyes are going to be popping like so yep Oop, that one flew <laughs> <laughs> okay and on to the next one you guys and this one is taking a minute but oh there it is and this is how the eyes look like so the next thing is nail polish I will remove all her makeup and nothing should stay behind you guys um, everything needs to go off her lips her eyes everything yep I want her nude I want to be able to do um, the paint and of course you know um, we do not want any makeup on him so yeah <laughs> and you see the potential after removing all the makeup, I have boiled some water, you guys, and I have added vinegar to it because I want the color to be um, so pigmented and vinegar helps. So with this one is going to be the dark brown and this is what I'm going to use for his hair. So, um, so I'm going to be eyeballing it and just putting the brown in the pot. okay and now it's time for me to dip his hair in the pot you guys let's see 
I'm so excited. Okay, so, oh, look at that. So um, the brown turned into this emerald green. Um, as we know, her hair um, is originally green. So in order for me to get rid of that, I'm gonna use basic um, color theory, guys. And I need to add the color red to be able to cancel out the green, you guys. So um, I'm going to go and set her aside for a minute or him and grab the color red. I have grabbed my red dye all purpose and that color is in red as well. You guys, I don't usually measure so it's really all by eye so I poured a little bit in there and I'm waiting for it to kind of boil together with the old one now I'm just gonna keep dipping him in and uh, I'm gonna try my best not to get burnt and not to burn um, or stain his um, skin as you guys could see I'm trying as much as I can not to have the color get on him um, so I'm gonna keep stirring the hair and here is the results you guys I will be setting him aside so he can cool down and then I'm going to add black to my brown mix and I want to dip all these clothes. You guys, I don't know how anything is going to turn out. And since I'm doing a dyeing party anyway, I'm going to dye some pieces just for the heck of it. Oh, look at that. Nope. <laughs> Not ready. Not ready, you guys. Um, yeah. So like I said, I'm going to be adding some more color. And I'm going to leave them in there and let them cook yeah you guys um i mean i like how things are looking let's see what happens these pants that i was hoping would turn black um are not responding with me so they're um kind of a green which i don't mind um and yeah so that's it for the dying party let's move on to the next step you guys um I decided to remove his eyebrows because I'm just gonna paint them back on and I wanted to spray him with Mr. Super Clear so right now he is all clean and I'm prepping him for um, yeah for the next step I'm going to um, spray him with Mr. Super Clear and then draw the eyebrows and let's go let's go and see what's gonna happen Actually, before I do all of this, I almost forgot I'm going to put back his eyes because I hate putting the eyes in at the end because I need the hot water so the face can be super soft and I could uh, basically just put the eyes back in. And here's the process. This makes the plastic soft where I'm able to push in the eyes, you guys, like so. And let's put in the other one. Hopefully it's easier. Um, it takes a bit of time, you guys, so you have to be patient. So here he is, and he's looking fabulous. I'm so happy, but I don't really care about his eyelashes. So we're gonna take those off. I'm going for someone who's masculine, so I feel like I want to just remove them. Now on to the next step, I'm going to prep him for Mr. Super Clear and then go on to removing the eyelashes. Um, here he is covered and now the next step is going to be the eyelashes you guys and I have found that the easiest way to do this is to use cuticle clips. Yes, it's so easy to just tug on them um, with those. So. Um, let me see where it is um yeah let's see right here you guys uh, this is what i'm gonna be using and i'm just going to literally be taking them off yeah i wasn't sure what i was gonna do but here you go just 
try to move it as much as possible. And you guys, you have to be very careful not to scratch the eyes. But yeah, here it is. Um, slowly but surely, I was able to do it. I don't know why, but I should have done this when the eyes were in hot water. But I guess I didn't know. Here he is. And oh, you guys, I'm so excited for him. He is looking so cool. Now, again, on to the next step. Um, I will be taping his eyes because if I spray him with Mr. Super Clear, um, it's matte and it will mattify the eyes, which I do not want to do that. Um, and I'm just going to show you how I do it. Painter's tape is the easiest tape to use. I just kind of um, put it there and see how the line is and get an exacto knife and just try to cut it very carefully around the eye. Now you guys that um, both eyes are getting prepped, uh, the next step is going to be um, Mr. Super Clear again. We're going to leave him for around 20 minutes after I spray him with two coats and then I'm going to use water pencils you guys and draw the eyes. I'm going to draw an outline a little small outline of the waterline as you guys can see I'm gonna do that to both eyes and then I will be moving on to his eyebrows here I am outlining um, the eyebrows you guys um, and I'm going to go as slow as possible to be able to get the results I want. Again, I'm still using the brown water color. After applying his eyebrows, you guys, as you could see, I'm trying to feather the eyebrows so I could mimic a real um, human eyebrow as much as possible. After finishing up the eyebrows, you guys, I did stuff off camera. I sprayed him with Mr. Super Clear so I could seal him. Then I attached the body back to the face. And you guys, um, I'm so excited to let you meet my new boy, Rainbow High. Please, you guys, if you do anything like that, be sure to tag me on social media and I cannot wait to see what you guys create. Here he is. I'll see you guys in my next video. Thank you for watching.